Hi, welcome back to Drew's Lab. Um, I've been given this Pulsar Apex 875 by my friends at Pulsar for a wee test. So I was quite excited because it feels a wee bit like Christmas in August. Anyway, so we've got the bag here and we've got the unit here. So I just thought I'd uh, do a wee video on this because I haven't done one for a wee while. Now the Apex 75 is basically just the same unit for back here but there's a, a larger lens here which uh, gives you a greater detection range and it's also this unit has got a greater magnification now <coughs> the unit is three uh, up to from three up to six power it's also got a 50 hertz core on it which keeps the picture really sharp um if you're turning quickly and it's also it's quite long this unit it's a wee, I would say probably it's a good 50 mil longer than the other, uh, like the the Apex 38 or 50, but it is a wee bit longer. Still very light though, I have to say. Um, I've got the battery cable in here because I'm going to make some videos later on. I'm going to try and do some distance videos for you to tag on here. Uh, it's got one shot zero with a picture frame, so it takes a picture when you fire your gun. You can either, and then you can put the crosshair on it, which is actually really useful. And it's also got picture in picture, which zooms right in in your target, which is pretty cool as well. There's really novel ideas with Pulsar, I've got to say. It's got manual calibration, it's got automatic calibration, which you need to do with thermals to keep the picture sharp. Um, the automatic makes a small noise, or you can do it manually. Um, it takes two CR123 batteries in here. Um, or you can put an external battery pack and clip it on here, usually the EPS3 unit, which is good. Um, it comes with the battery lead and remote control, bracket, batteries, allen keys, it's got all the stuff it should though because it isn't cheap, it's about 300,989 though if you want to book one on my site feel free, we'll take your money. So tonight I'm going to do some more videos uh, to tag on just to let you see how good this unit is and my friend's going to bring his wee dog out and we're going to set it at different distances because always people ask me all the time oh how far can you actually see with this thing so I'm going to use a wee terrier tonight and we're going to set it maybe 100 200 meters so if you want to keep watching um, we will give you some good feedback on this probably